In this video, I get together with a bunch of other YouTubers. All of their links will of course be down in the description. In today's challenge, we aren't allowed to touch grass. Yes, that's right, we can't touch grass. And if we do, it's almost instant death. Snowy, an awesome YouTuber, hosted this event, so big props to him. Of course, like I said, his link will be in the description. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, the last one to survive will win $100. So make sure to watch till the end to find out who is the winner. Alrighty, alrighty, enough jibber jabber, let's get started. I started off by staircasing down because I couldn't really do anything on the surface knowing there was only grass. But I quickly got bored of this and I broke the number one rule of Minecraft. Never dig straight down. However, it did end up paying off. I ended up getting a bunch of iron and diamonds before then building up another portal to go to the nether. But once I went through the nether, there was no going back. Once I went through the portal, I was hopping around careless without a care in the world and then BAM! Hunger hit and I didn't have any food. I decided to play it risky and kill some hoglins and thank goodness I didn't die doing this. Once I got a little bit more food, I started looking around for the nether fortress. Once I found it, I gathered up a bunch of blaze rods for some potions. However, I overlooked the fact that I needed some nether wart before I went to the surface, so I guess no potions for me. Before I got out on the surface, I found a flower forest where I was able to tame some dogs and even get an enchant table where I was able to get some enchants on all of my armor and some of my tools. Anyway, on my way going slowly into the middle of the map, I actually found a dog and even went through a village. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, in the middle of the map, there's a bunch of netherite that Snowy said that of course we could use. So of course, I tried to mine up this netherite block as fast as humanly possible so I could upgrade all of my diamond gear. Luckily, after I make my smithing table and the netherite, no one ended up seeing me. However, my tug here almost did push me off into the grass. That would have been a terrible way to go. I pulled up here in the middle of the map where CWG was, and after a close call of him bowing me, he even had the audacity to say this. Bring it on. Dog master. After he said that, I knew I had to bring the fight to him. However, right before I had to jump, one of my dogs had died. For this sad passing of one of my dogs, I just thought to myself, after everything I've done, getting diamonds, gearing up, enchanting, and getting my amazing, amazing dogs, I knew I was not only doing this for myself, but for my fallen dog. So, I went for the jump. It was at this moment that he knew. He messed up. And well, I died. <laughs> oh come on, you didn't think it was that easy to kill me? I didn't of course die, are you kidding me? Play the actual clip. Yeah, that's right, I made it! I clutched on a slab and I even ran into CWG's house. CWG then hopped on top of his house, therefore he had the high ground. But at this moment, I remembered about the art of war. In the midst of chaos, there is also opportunity. Sun Tzu, the art of war. With this advice, I remembered, this is Minecraft, I can break blocks, so I decided to mine the roof and jump above him. Somehow, he didn't see me. I ended up using this to my advantage by surprise attacking him to finally kill CWG. So ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the final fight of the event. So yeah, I ended up winning the entire event and getting the $100, and really quickly, here is my live reaction of winning. Oh my god, Pushlim, you actually won! No way, dude! <laughs> that was close. Snowy did end up telling me after the event that he was going to be end up donating to me the $100 in my next stream, so next time you see me streaming, make sure to go look out for that and that'll end up happening hopefully relatively soon. I just want to give a huge shout out to Snowy for letting me play in the event and CWG for inviting me. They both already have their views and perspectives up online and their links will be down in the description for their channels. But anyway, that is going to be it for me guys and I will see you all next time.